that I'm late, but I had to stop and get a fat-free, low-calorie cheesecake for our Overeaters Anonymous meeting today. Oh, good. How's everybody doing? Good. Today, great. Well, um, for those of you that don't know me, I'm Vicki, and I'm the nurse that is going to help you guys talk about your overeating habits. Some have been here a while, and some of them haven't, so why don't we just go around and talk about our successes this week. So, so did you want to tell me about some of your successes this week? I didn't have a whole lot of successes this week. You know, I, I failed another med surge test, and to console myself, I went home, and, and I bought this cheesecake, and look, I ate half of it just last night, and I'm still eating it. Girl, you didn't eat the whole thing, so don't worry about it. I mean, really, you could have ate the whole thing, but instead you just ate, yeah, I think that's something worth, a, you know, give yourself a hand, you only ate half. Yeah. 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 Don't you did good? That's great. You could it could have been a lot worse. How about you, Tara? Me too. I had three tests in two days, and then I worked and my kids. I I, I had to go out and I had to drink a lot of alcohol on Friday night, Aww. and then on the way home I stopped and got about forty dollars for the Taco Bell. Taco Bell. But I got the Supreme, so I got the lettuce and tomato one. Uh, exactly. So you got tacos? Yeah, I got tacos. Oh, did you get a bean burrito? Oh, a couple of those. Okay, well. It's okay because you got the tacos, and the tacos, you know, they're only like 120 calories. Yeah, that's what I figured. Oh, yeah, don't even worry about it. So that's not too bad. You did a good job. All right, so you got some tacos with that Taco Bell. Good job. Let's give her a nice round of applause. Awesome. And Mary, how about you? Any good success stories? Yeah, actually, I did really well. I was also stressed out with three tests in two days, and I decided to go for a jog, and I stayed under my calorie um, allowance and then I decided to take my dog for a walk so I just I feel so great oh now Mary you took your dog for a walk Did, didn't you tell me last week that your dog had arthritis yeah oh that probably wasn't too good for the dog was it probably not mm. well you know maybe next time you can just do the walk on your own without the dog okay okay well good job anyway <laughs> and how about you now you're new so um, why don't you tell us, you know, some success you had this week? Did you have any, or? Um, maybe. I, I've been kind of broke and a lot of medical bills, so I've been eating Kraft macaroni and cheese for lunch and dinner every day. Oh, well, that's not bad. The, the noodles are pasta, and then, of course, the cheese is a great source of dairy. Cheese is good for you, right? Yeah, it's right. great for you, so awesome job. Okay, well good, um, you know, it's really difficult to, to open up sometimes, and I'm really glad you guys opened up. I actually think we should actually treat ourselves right now. I brought some cake, and it's only 400 calories per slice, so wow. let's all dig in. Yeah. Yeah. After you went to the bathroom, then what happened? Um, I had to take a shower. In the shower you saw the razor? Yes. And you thought you wanted to hurt yourself? Yes. Um, you can tell she thinks you're crazy. Well, I got up and I put my clothes on and then I went um, to the shower and took a shower. And when it was, um, I saw, um, I took a shower, and then when I got out, um, I took my clothes off, and then I went to my room, and then there was a razor there, and she's not listening to you. Um, I cut myself. Okay, so what, let's go back. You stated that you got up, and you got dressed, and took a shower. And then after your, sh your shower, you got dressed again? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got up, and I went to the shower. And then after the shower, I got dressed. Worthless. And then I came back to you the room, and the razor was in the room. 